Hey guys, it's me Betsy again. I just thought I'd post a video as to what was in my sun bag as I'll call it. Which basically I just keep stuff in it like if I'm going to be out in the sun or... Well, when I will be out in the sun and if like they have like a shower where you could wash up or whatever. Clean up. Freshen up whatever. So I have all that in this bag other than this, which won't fit in there. But I do carry that, which I will get to probably at some point during the video. So basically this, this bag came in a set from Charming Charlie's. Um, it, it was this bag... Like a journal type thing. Um, I want to call it like a journal carrying case. It had like a pouch thing that came with it. Um, like a coffee mug or a, like a mug that you can put like hot or cold in it. And an umbrella. A neighbor had given this to me. I think it was either for my birthday or it was a Christmas present. And when I lived out in Michigan with a friend of mine so let's get into it so let's if that will stay down let's see well that works <laughs> i just didn't want to stay down so i used a clip so in here let's see I have, let's see, and this I have as well, but I carry this around daily, which it also won't fit. It is way too big, but I have, like, a few different things of sunblock here that I carry. Um, okay, this is the... Hawaiian Tropic Sensitive Skin. I don't have sensitive skin at all, but I like how using the um, stick form. But this is just basically a stick, and I use, or a sunblock stick. It's SPF 50. Um, and I actually just use this on my face instead of putting um, this. This is SPF 30. And I got this at some, I think I got this at, yeah, I got this at a mud run. And it was just like some samples that they were giving away at one of the tables that they had there. But it's SPF 30, um, and it has, I can get this, and it has like a spongy thing and, let me see, the sunblock comes out of the middle there, and this way you don't have to touch the sunblock if you don't want to but I do not like putting the liquid or the spray on my face because then it runs into my eyes and that is so annoying so I use this stick for my face which it does not run it kind of goes on like Vaseline if you want to call it that but it Something similar to Vaseline. And then this is the Equate um, value size. Or I guess if you want to call it a family size, you could. Um, but it's the Broad Spectrum SPF 50. But yeah, this I carry around daily because... I burn very easily, so I always have to apply sunblock when I'm out, because SPF 30 does nothing for me. I kind of made that mistake, I think it was last year, or the year before, I ended up using um, the spray of the Hawaiian Tropic, like this, like this kind of, the um, Hawaiian Tropic version of, like, the spray. And it was an SPF 30, and I kept, like, reapplying it, and I ended up getting 
burnt. Like, kind of bad. It was, like, at that point where... Which just brings me to the next thing. Um, it didn't... Like, aloe vera wasn't even working. Because what I do with this... I actually did a video about this and coconut oil. Which, there's another video about that in the hacks playlist if you want to go check that out but aloe vera didn't work like I literally had to use coconut oil because this was not even touching it after I think a week or even like a couple of days of using it it was like a couple like four or five like three or four days after using this straight like it wasn't relieving anything of my sunburn so yeah but i here i just had the, the regular liquid aloe vera and then let's see i know i have one more thing in here that's sunblock related so here this is um the same brand as that it's from a company called shared solutions i don't know where they're based out of but they were at a mud run that I did, I think it was like last year or the year before. So basically in the last year or so, last year or two I did it and got these. But this is just lip balm and it has SPF, Let's see if it will focus. No? No, kind of. SPF 23 in it. So, no one likes getting, at least me, I don't like getting burnt lips, which I never really do, and even if I did, that would be horrible, and it would suck, and kissing would suck if you're in a relationship with somebody. Like, burnt lips just aren't the best, so you got to protect your lips. So, I always try to find lip chapstick, lip balm, whatever you want to call it, with the SPF in it. Um, another good brand, if you can't find any, is this brand. It's the uh, Baby Lips. And this is this has the SPF 20 in it, which I love. Which, it's basically almost gone. Like, literally, like, it's almost gone. Because <laughs> I use it almost all the time. Really, but that's all I have left of that. So yeah. But if you can't find anything with like an SPF in it, baby lips is the way to go. Um, let's see. Another good thing, like they're gonna be out, which now brings me to that as well. Um bug repellent if you're going to be out at night especially like if you after being out like all day in the sun you're going to be out at night you're going to want bug repellent because i sure in the heck don't like getting bit by mosquitoes or any other kind of bugs in general so bug repellent is good um so now to this like this, I like, I love the Avon Skin So Soft line, like, especially the original. It smells so good. But this will actually, depending on where you live in the world, uh, but here in New Jersey, the U.S., where I live, this stuff works great. Like, I rarely ever even get bit using the Skin So Soft original. And this is, you can use the, um, the liquid spray, but this is the, um, gelled body oil, or is it oil, not the lotion spray, whatever. Um, but yeah, this works just the same as that, so I, ha I do have both of those. So this brings me to this now, which you're probably going to wonder, well, like, why in the heck do you carry this? So basically, um, I carry here, I have shampoo, conditioner, body wash, 
and a little bit more body wash because this one doesn't have much in it. Um, the only reason we're, and a washcloth. The only reason why I really carry these, especially like if you're down to shore, you can. They have showers, I guess, throughout the boardwalk, depending on where you go. Um, but this way, like, I can just wash my hair real quick with the shampoo and conditioner, and I can also wash my body off if I have the time to do so. And then I just, I would take, like, a plastic bag and then um, put this in it if it's wet and put that aside and leave that leave that out of that bag another thing that I do carry which I don't have in here is that I actually carry um, extra hair ties because if you're like me you have long hair I always use these um, in my hair like my hair is always up 99% of the time so I always have like backups in case my hair tie breaks or I'm with other people and there's breaks or they forgot one I have spares I also carry a hairbrush with me or all the time so that's not in here so that's in another bag of mine that I my day bag which I will make a video about what's in that so I have those. Um, another hair, well, another hair product that I carry is not your mother's um, Beach Babe texturizing sea salt spray. I do use this um, occasionally. This everything here is basically travel size except for the sunblock. And if I carry this, then there's loose in my bag. But this this stuff is amazing. Like I love using this in my hair, especially if I'm down at the beach or just like in general, like I'm gonna be washing my hair in the next day or so. Like I can use this and then I can just wash it out. But I like using this stuff. Like, I don't use it that often. So that's why I have the um, travel size, if you want to call it that. Yeah, the travel size. It's two fluid ounces. So, yeah, I like that stuff. I, I do carry, like, regular, again, Avon. I do carry lotion around with me just to keep my hands moisturized and my arms moisturized and everything nobody likes to have dry skin in the summer um with that i have this was like another sample thing that i got at um like a craft show or flea market or something a craft show that's what it was so it's great like it works it's hand sanitizer and plus, the good thing is with this is that you can um, refill it if you have, like, a bigger bottle. And just refill it and keep it in your bag. And I, oh, and I lost my bag. I also have here body spray. This came in a set that my neighbor had gotten. And she gave me, like, three of these. I got this cotton field I got like an avocado one I think and like a lavender one so once this is all used up I will clean it out so that the smell is not really in there anymore and I'll use like a take whatever's left in the bigger bottle and I will pour it into here and use that Thanks. There's one more item that I want to show you guys. And I just lost my texturizing spray. 
But in here, like, we all get them. These are just sample perfumes. Let's see if I can do this. I'm holding my phone in a weird way. But even, um, like, you can get them. They come in, like, the mail. They come in the newspaper, at least around here, like, once a week or once once in a while they do come in the, the paper. But at, at Christmas they come in, like, the Macy's magazine. So, and you could probably even go to the store and ask for samples of these. Well, there goes my bag again, but that's okay. See, what I would, think is this one is so large, like, you could get, let's say, four. If you cut this in fours. You could probably get four uses out of this one page, which is probably like a 8 by 10 page, give or take. But, yeah, I have different, like, hold on to those. Like, those are amazing to have in your bag. Like, I keep them in just about every bag that I carry with me in my day bag. I have, like, a set, like, this in a Ziploc, which I got the bags from Walmart in the jewelry section. Um, they do have like other ones that are they're called like portion control packs or something like that. But I got these in the jewelry section. There's like three different sizes. There's this size, which is the biggest size, and then they have like one that's maybe it's like that let's see it's like that in size it's like smaller than this and then they have like a like one that's a little smaller than it's about a little smaller than this with it folded up so here's the the one size in the jewelry and then they have like a smaller tinier one than that that's half the size of that but yeah but if you get these sample packs of men's they have men's ones too but men's and women's perfume hold on to them like stick them in your travel bag like your toiletry bag and this way you're not taking like your glass bottle of perfume with you like your favorite one and then next thing you know it breaks and it's all over the place in your all your stuff smells like it. But yeah, that's pretty much it as to what's in my date, my what's in my sun bag. So don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you next time. Bye.